New at 10, it's called Raccoon Rock. The animals are everywhere on Lakeview's lakefront, with video after video of people hand feeding them popping up on social media. City departments tell CBS 2's Tara Molina why that needs to stop now. One, two, three. We lost count. But people who frequent this trail guess in the dozens. Like over 30. With these lakefront rocks just south of Matros Harbor becoming quite the hot spot just for this. Late in the afternoon, we caught more than one person showing up here, some driving in from the suburbs, food in hand. But to feed the family of raccoons. Like this man, who didn't want to share his name on camera, but told us he's been coming here with leftovers for years, comfortable with the growing number of animals that call this area home. They know him, they climb on him, and they never, he never got bitten or something. Chicago's Park District that oversees this area is not okay with what's going on here, but they haven't done anything about this. A spokesperson told us, quote, we ask visitors not to feed wildlife in parks or along the lakefront for their own safety and the health and wellness of the animals. Chicago Animal Care and Control shared the same message. Don't feed the raccoons. Outside of the obvious concerns that come with hand feeding wild animals, raccoons are rabies carriers and can transfer other diseases and pests like roundworm, according to the Humane Society. They're protected by state code and there's nothing on the books that makes feeding them illegal, but this is technically littering and is subject to those rules, according to Chicago police. We reported on this same issue in this same area years ago. Some of the animals actually had to be trapped and removed because people continued to feed them. Reporting near Montrose Harbor tonight, I'm Tara Molina, CBS 2 News. Oh, they appear to be well fed. Yeah, very plump there. Mm -hmm.